through sound, they can just say rrrr. Now let's sing. What is the sound of letter R? Rrr, 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 rrr. That's right, everyone. Letter R. Now, Wonder Box, let's review how to say the rrr sound. Wonder Box says, when making the sound of letter R or rrr, you should pull back the tongue and up but not touching the roof of the mouth. Now, let's practice saying the sound of R once more. Rrr. For those people having trouble saying the rrr sound, remember to practice the w sound first because that's how you start the rrr sound. When making the w sound, you do your lips like this. W, but you rest your tongue. Then, when making the rrr sound, you pull back the tongue and a little up but not touching the roof of the mouth. Just like this. Rrrr. That's it. That's how we make the sound of the letter R. Rrrr. Thank you, Wonderbox, for our letter of the day and also your tip to practicing so that we can practice saying the sound of letter R. Now, let's look at the pictures of kids holding things that begin with the letter R. Sabi ni Zia, Viana, Oliver, 3 years old from Quezon City, R is for ruler. Hindi nang sinabi ni Krisha May Estomata, 9 years old from San Pablo City, Laguna, R is for ruler. Sabi naman ni Aliana Masina, 3 years old, from San Mateo, Rizal, R is for rabbit and R is for ribbon. Thank you, kids! Thank you rin sa mga nag-send sa amin ng pictures na yan. Patindi ng patindi at tuloy-tuloy ang pagpapakita ng galing ng ating mga TNG aspirants. Abangan ng kanilang performances sa pinakamalaking talent competition sa buong bansa, Tagisan ng Galing. This program is presented by SMC Infrastructure, building a better world. Sanding sugar-free white coffee, puno ng white coffee taste. Without the sugar, kaya lower calories. Try mo na, sanding sugar-free white coffee. Sarap ng white coffee, now sugar-free. VetaBrew NutriChance, the only premium dog food with active boost for optimum energy and prebiotics that helps strengthen immunity. Just like Catherine Bernardo, going listo, ganado ang fur babies niyo. Listo ganado sa NutriChance. Magnolia chicken templados, delicious, ready to cook and freshly marinated daily. Pure Foods Lunch and Meat, pure sarap for every family. Star Chunky Cheese Corned Beef, ang cheesy ng corned beef mo. Walang duda, kids can tell na number one ang Pure Foods standard. Ang juicy, ang tender, ang juicy, ang sarap. Co-presented by Cooper, expert in air conditioning and electromechanical. Also engaged in structural, electrical, fire protection, plumbing, and sanitary services. Cooper, your ultimate MEPS and air conditioning solutions. Ulan Incorporated International, fight against global poverty. New San Jose Builders Incorporated. Canrib Corporation, your ventilation and air conditioning specialist. Vita Herbs Philippines Green Coffee, masarap, mabango, at healthy pa. Puerto Rico Resort and Convention Center, Cabiao Nueva Ecija. I love Puerto Rico. In participation with Rain or Shine Elastomeric Waterproofing Paint, Matinko. R Square Variables Incorporated, CompuZell Computer Services, SciShow International Trading Corporation, DN Steel, EMAC UPB Roof Corporation. Hey, Aggression Ho here, and I'm a white coffee lover. Creamy kasi, and very yummy, pero mas masarap kung hindi nakaka-guilty. Check my new discovery, San May Sugar-Free White Coffee. Puno ng white coffee taste without the sugar, kaya lower calories. Try mo na! San May Sugar-Free White Coffee. 
sarap ng white coffee, now sugar-free. The South Luzon Expressway, a 36-kilometer long road that runs from Alabang to Santo Tomas, Batangas, connects several commercial and residential areas in the Greater Manila and the provinces of Laguna, Cavite, and Batangas. This will soon be extended all the way to the province of Quezon. Listo at ganado ang baby ko sa VET-approved Nutri-Chunks with active boost and prebiotics na pampalisto. Made with real meat, with essential nutrients to help them grow healthy and happy. Listo, ganado sa Nutri-Chunks. Bakit natin ipinagluluto ang mga mahal natin? We want them to feel special. Sa meaty lunch and meat that we serve. If your pure intentions had a taste, it would taste like pure foods. Pure sarap. Pure foods lunch and meat. Kid Kwento is back. Yan. Kanina, pinag-usapan natin ang ating letter for this week, which is the letter R. Now, it's time for Wonder Dictionary. Wonder Dictionary, let's review our word of the week. Resourceful. At let's spell resourceful using sign language alphabet. Ready? Let's set, go. R E S O U R C E F U L. Resourceful. Again, Wonder Dictionary, what does resourceful mean? Wonder Dictionary says, Resourceful means having the ability to find quick and clever ways to overcome difficulties. And let's have another meaning for the word resourceful. Wonder Dictionary says, Resourceful also means being able to find and use available resources to solve problems and achieve goals. Sa Filipino, ang ibig sabihin ng salitang resourceful ay mapamaraan. Pag ang isang tao ay mapamaraan, kahit na magmakarana siya ng mga problema, malalampasan niya yon sa pagkakaroon ng pag-iisip, matalinong pag-iisip, pagiging malikhain at paghahanap ng iba't ibang solusyon sa kanyang problema. That means even if there are things that hinder us from doing something, we just have to be creative, think, and find a way to have things done by using what's available. Halimbawa, meron tayong gustong gawin, pero wala tayong gamit. Kailangan lang natin maging observant. Maghanap tayo ng solusyon. At kapag ang tao ay naghahanap ng solusyon at na Matalino siyang nag-iisip, siya ay mapamaraan o resourceful. Now, Wonder Dictionary says, how about we use the word resourceful in a sentence? We can make a sentence by looking at the picture and using the word resourceful. Remember that resourceful is an adjective. It means that resourceful describes a person or it describes a person, and that means we're going to describe what we see in the picture. Okay, pero bago yon, basahin muna natin ang tip ni Wonder Dictionary. To help you describe and make a sentence, here's Wonder Dictionary's tip. Wonder Dictionary says, Use WH questions to talk about the details of a picture and put them together to make a sentence. Let's try that out. Let's look at this picture. Remember that WH questions can be who, what, or where, and also when and why. But for now, we will use who, what, and where. First question, who do we see in the picture? The answer is the boy, right? Now, what is he doing? Second question, what is he doing? Look at the picture. He is playing hopscotch or piko in Filipino. Correct. Next question. 
Where is he? Let's look. He is inside the house. That's right. Now, let's go back to the meaning of the word resourceful for our fourth question. Did the boy show being resourceful by finding a clever way to do something that he likes? Yes, he is resourceful because he used tape to make to use it for his hopscotch game. So let's put together those answers and make a sentence. And here is our sentence. The boy is resourceful because he used tape to play hopscotch inside the house. See, that's it. That's how to make a sentence. Remember, you can use WH questions. If you want to make a long sentence or a detailed sentence, you can use WH questions to add details to your sentence. The sentence that we made was a sentence that describes the boy in the picture. That's why it's called a descriptive sentence. Thank you, Wonder Dictionary, for our word of the week. And thank you for helping us make a sentence as well. We will be posting our vocabulary tips on our Facebook page. So don't forget to visit, okay? Just look for Net25Kids. Now, it's time for our question of the day. Here's Wonder Tablet for our question of the day. Wonder Tablet asks, how can we be resourceful? Good question, Wonder Tablet. Again, how can we be resourceful? And the answer to our question of the day, Wonder Tablet says, In order to be resourceful, one must have the following characteristics. 1. Be observant. 2. Be creative. 3. Be perseverant. And four, be proactive. Remember, last time, Teacher Delay discussed and showed to us how we can become resourceful. She even showed to us a book that she covered with some old magazine and art paper. Diba? Resourceful yun. Kahit wala siyang pambalot sa kanyang libro, gumamit siya ng lumang magazine at iba't ibang tira-tirang mga art paper para makagawa ng magandang pambalot para sa kanyang libro. And that was truly resourceful. Now, let's continue talk, talking about being resourceful by watching our new video on our Learn and Teach with Wonder series. Let's watch this video. How can we become resourceful? Being resourceful means... Being able to find and use available resources to solve problems and achieve goals. Did you know that being resourceful can help us become successful in life? In order for us to be resourceful, we need to have different characteristics. These are be observant, be creative. Be perseverant. Be proactive. Number one, be observant. Do you have a problem that needs a solution? A project that you need to do, but you have limited resources? Observe your surroundings. Scan your resources. You can also use other means to solve problems like researching or asking people around you. Number two, be creative. If you lack resources, use your imagination and come up with other solutions. You might also need to create another plan to solve your problem. If plan A doesn't work, then have a plan B or even a plan C. Number three, be perseverant. In order to be resourceful, don't give up easily. Be flexible in your thinking and just try and try and try until you come up with a possible solution. Number four, be proactive. Do the things you can do now instead of doing them later. 
Learn from your mistakes. You can use these experiences to think and act ahead. Remember, being resourceful can help us become successful in life. Today, we have been discussing about being resourceful. We have learned that in order to be resourceful, we need to be observant, creative, perseverant, and proactive. Now, it's time for our Kid Cuento of the Day. Hooray! Last time, we mentioned that difficult times like these can also be a good learning opportunity to teach kids about being resourceful and other positive characteristics like being thankful. Before, we have shown you a video of Alexia holding a cardboard box TV and thanking our frontliners who help the community. This time, let's watch her brother and let's see what resourceful story does he have for us today. Let's watch our Kid Cuento of the Day. Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Nais ko pong maipakita sa inyo ang aking ginawang movie poster para maalala po natin ang mga ginawang sakripisyo ng ating mga frontliners. Presenting! Dr. Iron! Nurse Widow! Captain Nurse! Hope Soldier! Chief Furry! Doctor Strange, Star Delivery, Vendor Shooting, Vendor Defender, Assemble Frontliners Endgame for Coronavirus. Dear Frontliners, Salamat po sa pagtulong at sa pagprotekta niyo po sa amin at ipagpatuloy niyo po ang ginagawa niyo. Ginagawa niyo po Magtiwala lang po kayo sa Diyos at ipapanangin po namin kayo. Saludo po kami sa inyo. Ako po si Ran Elijah V. Arenas. Pinapakita ang aking movie poster. Salamat sa iyo, Rahan Elijah V. Arenas. Galing sa Manggahan General Rias Cavite. Hooray! Ang galing ni Rahan, di ba? Si Rahan ay 9 years old. At sa video ni Rahan, pinakita niya na kanyang na-appreciate ang mga sakripisyo ng ating mga frontliners. Good job, Rahan! Remember, for the parents out there, you can be resourceful and use our current situation to teach kids about being kind and looking up to people who are helpful and should be appreciated. Tulad ng mga frontliners. Ang galing ng kwento ni Rahan tung tungkol sa frontliners, di ba? At nagpakita siya ng isang movie poster. Ipopost din namin yan sa aming Facebook page. Kaya visit nyo na lang ang Net25 Kids FB page. Yup! Superheroes need not have capes. Hindi nila kailangan na lumilipad at magkaroon ng powers. Ang kailangan lang ng isang tao upang maging hero o bayani ay gumawa ng kabutihan sa kanyang kapwa. You can also be a hero just by being kind and helpful to others. And we should appreciate the frontliners who have been helping our community. Again, we would like to thank you our senders, Joey Wakalia, Yana Christine Victoriano, at ang parents si Alexia at ni Rahan, sina Ernie and Evelyn Arenas. Maraming salamat po sa inyo! Ah, again, we are out of time. But of course, before we go, let's find out our Wonder Message for the Week brought to us by Wonderboard.
Wonder Bar shares that our wonder, wonder message for the week is being resourceful is an important skill to be successful in life. Tandaan natin yan. Dapat maging mapamaraan tayo. Makakatulong kasi yan para tayo ay maging matagumpay sa buhay. At kahit makaranas tayo ng challenges o mga medyo nahihirapan tayo, tandaan naman ang mga challenges na yan ay makapagtuturo sa atin. Challenges that we experience can also be a good resource to teach positive traits like being a problem solver, being kind, and appreciative of people around you. Wonderboard, what are the other things that we have learned for today? Number one, Wonderboard says our letter of the day is the letter R. Number two, to make the R sound, pull back the tongue and up, but not touching the roof of the mouth. Number three, our word of the day is resourceful. Number four, Resourceful means having the ability to find quick and clever ways to overcome difficulties. Number five, use WH questions or like who, what, where, when, why, and how to talk about the details of a picture and then put them together to make a descriptive sentence. Number six, in order for us to be resourceful, we need to be observant, creative, perseverant, and proactive. Lastly, we learned today that difficult times like these can also be a good learning opportunity to teach kids about being resourceful and other positive characteristics like being kind and helpful. Hooray! We continue to invite everyone to like and share this video and also all our social media accounts. You can look, up, look us up at Facebook. Just look for facebook.com slash net25kids. We are also in Pinterest, Twitter, and Instagram. Just look for net25kids. If you have suggestions, comments, or recommendations, email us at net25kids at gmail.com. If you want to know more about us, please visit our website. That's www.net25kids.com. And remember that our online shows on Net25Kids Facebook page are, and YouTube channel are also on Net25 TV. You can watch Kid Cuento every Mondays and Wednesdays at 4 to 4.30 p.m. And also, you can watch Ate DJ sa Anong Sa Inyo every Tuesdays and Thursdays at 4 to 4.30 p.m. Para sa maliliit na bata na gustong matuto ng mga ng pagdodrawing at sa mga ate, kuya, nanay at tatay na gusto magkaroon ng iba't ibang DIY projects, manood kayo ng Art Time, Saturdays and Sundays, 8.30 to 9 a.m. Ang show namin sa Radyo Aguila 1062, tuwing Fridays 3 to 4 p.m. na Be Brighter, ay nasa TV rin. Mapapanood ito sa Net25 TV every Fridays 3 at 4 to 4.30 p.m. Subscribe din kayo sa aming YouTube channel. Just look for Net25Kids. At click on the notification bell so that you would know every time we upload a new video. Ayan. Batiin natin ang ating mga greeters. Ayan. Hello sa ating mga greeters. Maraming pong salamat sa patuloy niyo pong pagsubaybay sa aming mga videos. Simulan po natin kay Prince Arvir Garcia. Sabi niya, happy viewing po from Project 4 Quezon City. Hello po sa inyo. Hello din po daw sa inyong lahat, sabi niya. Keep safe po. Sa iyo rin, keep safe po. At galing naman po kay Ma'am Emmy Kapili Taroha na gusto ko rin po pala, palang pasalamatan dahil picture ni Elijah, na kanyang anak, ang ginamit natin picture doon sa ating sentence making, sa practicing sentence writing kay Wonder Dictionary, si Elijah Taroha. Sabi po ni Ma'am Emmy Kapili Taroha, thank you so much, Teacher Sally. And we would also like to greet everyone in North Brisbane, Australia East. And also our family love, our family or their loved ones in Davao City. Hello po. Sabi naman po ni Garcia Ann, hello po, happy viewing from Ottawa, Canada. Hello po sa inyo. At sabi po ni Roland Torres, hello po, happy viewing. At bumabati rin po si Elsa Puno. Happy viewing from St. Laurent, Ottawa. 
Hello po sa inyong lahat at special hello naman po para po sa sumusunod na mga mahal namin sa buhay. Happy birthday po kay Nanay Elena Evora from Kawasaki, Japan! Happy birthday po! Ayan, happy birthday po sa inyo, Nanay Elena. Si Nanay Elena ang lola po ni BBL. At syempre, mommy ni Daddy Jen. Yan, happy birthday at special happy birthday din po kay Ma'am Presi Cruz. Hello po, Ma'am Pets. Ayan, happy birthday po si Ma'am Pets po ay galing sa Eagle Broadcasting Corporation. Hello po, Ma'am Pets. Happy birthday. Happy birthday na rin sa lahat ng mga nagdidiwang ng kanilang birthdays. At kahit nasaan man kayo, sana kayong lahat ay ligtas. At keep safe po ha. Tandaan natin na dapat... Lagi tayong isipin natin ang ating kapwa at lagi nating isipin ang kaligtasan natin. And today was really a fun day. We learned about being resourceful and we also learned about the different things that we can do even wherever you are. Ayan. So today was really a fun day and remember, let's all read to succeed and also learn and teach with wonder. I am... Teacher Sally, and we live in interesting times. Bye bye.